Hey what's good I'm Sadia and in this video I'm going to show you two ways on how you can create a circle face cam in Final Cut Pro so let's go. Cool so first you want to create a new project so let's just call it circle face cam set your properties as you wish and then hit OK. Then what you want to do is drag in your well we'll go through the first method so you want to drag in drag in your footage so I'm just using a, a video I've already edited and then what you want to do is go into the effects panel here and then go down under video you want to go into masks or you can just search and then you want image mask sorry no you want shape mask so drag that into the clip you can close that and once you drag it in you can see this appear here so you can manually play with it um, so you can make it a rounded square you can make it uh, you can make it a circle by dragging it in like this or what you could do is just amend the properties here so you can adjust the radius like so you can adjust the curvature so obviously we want a circle so literally just leave it 100% and that's it you're done how easy was that so you you'll notice that it's quite blurred around the edges so to fix that and make it a bit more solid you want to adjust the feather prop property here so you can just bring it down a bit. I'm just gonna bring it down to 15 because I think that's pretty solid. If we just play that back, you can see it looks a lot more better. It looks a lot better. Obviously, if you want the blurred sort of effect, then yeah, just increase the feather like so, but I'm gonna leave mine at 15. And there you go, there you have it. Uh, the other thing you can do actually is invert mask, which is this over here. What that'll do is basically it'll take out everything from the middle as opposed to ha taking off everything from the outside so if you do this you might want to add an image inside that bit or another video even so I'm just going to add a logo just to show you what I mean so let me make that a bit smaller so you could have the video like this where there's always something in the center it's probably not a normal case or a commonly used case but if you wanted to, but we're gonna go back and hit invert mask, uh, in fact, make invert mask disabled. So you have it like so. And that's the first method, super, super easy. So I'm just gonna delete that. And now I'm gonna show you the second way to do it, which personally, I think this the first method is a lot quicker and easier, but there is another way. So what you wanna do is go here and under generators, go into elements and select shapes and bring that, drag that in. Then what you want to do is go to your clip, your video clip that is, and again go into effects and select image mask. Just drag that into your clip. Let's close that. And then what you'll notice on the video under the video inspector is this image mask setting. You need to choose a source, so click the little arrow and just choose the shape that you added. Hit apply clip and then we can hide that layer by hitting V or just remove it entirely and there you go you've got your circle so yeah it's really easy both methods are fairly easy to be honest but I think the first one's a little quicker but yeah I hope you found this video useful if you did be sure to hit that like button and as always thank you for watching peace